Hey guys, I love this problem. It says the width is twice the height. If the perimeter is 120, what is the area? And we're given that the width is x squared minus x minus 16, and the height is x plus 12. If you want to try this on your own, pause it right now, because I'm going to solve it in three, two, one. There are two ways to solve this one. I'm going to show you both ways. We'll do the hard way first, and then I'll show you the shortcut. So it says the width is twice the height. For the width, I'm going to plug in the x squared minus x minus 16. And that's going to be equal to two times the height, where the height is this x plus 12. Then we can distribute this to, it'll be 2x plus 24. Then since it's a quadratic, let's set it equal to zero. So we can subtract 2x from both sides and subtract 24 from both sides. Let's bring down the x squared, negative x minus 2x is negative 3x, and negative 16 minus 24 is negative 40, and that will all be equal to 0. So we can factor this. We need two numbers that add to negative 3 and multiply to negative 40. That's going to be negative 8 and positive 5. Negative 8 plus 5 is negative 3, and negative 8 times 5 is negative 40. So we can plug those in here. Now, since this times this is equal to zero, we know either this equals zero or this equals zero, which means either x equals eight or x equals negative five. Now let's test our solution. So let's take the x equals negative five and let's plug it in. Negative five plus 12 gives us seven. And this will be 25 plus 5, which is 30, minus 16 is 14. The perimeter would be equal to 14 plus 7 plus 14 plus 7, which is only 42. We need the perimeter to be 120, and that does not equal 42. So x equals negative 5 is an extraneous solution. Next, let's try x equals 8. So let's plug in 8 for all the x's. We get 20 on the height, and 8 squared is 64, minus 8 is 56, minus 16 is 40. 40 is twice as big as 20. And for the perimeter, 40 plus 20 plus 40 plus 20 does give us 120. So x equals eight is our solution. And the question is asking, what is the area? 40 times 20 is 800, and we can give it a label of units squared. So that is the answer to our question, 800 units squared. So now would you like to see the alternative method? These are a trap, we don't need these. So we can just assign h for the height and call the width 2h, because the width is twice the height. So we need the perimeter to be 120. That means we need h plus 2h plus h plus 2h to equal 120. And h plus 2h plus h plus 2h is equal to 6h. After we divide both sides by six, we get h equal to 20. So we can plug in 20 for these h's and the two h's will become 40. 40 plus 20 plus 40 plus 20 gives us 120. And then the area will be 40 times 20, which is 800 units squared. And that's the answer to the question. How exciting. So which method did you like more?